In today's video, we're going to talk about something that can happen, but may never happen to you. But my first point I want to make sure you catch as you watch this is if you do run into a, a problem with a plug-in or any part of Man of the Box, the first thing I've learned to do is to get on pgmusic.com during normal business hours, use their live chat. They're excellent. They helped me solve the problem I'm going to talk about today, and they can help you too. So with that in mind, here's my experience. Hi, this week, I'd like to talk to you about how to debug or troubleshoot the band in the box DAW plugin standalone. This is an issue I had. You may never have it, but what you see on the screen before you is a song I was working on. The only thing that is unique about it is instead of the standard 32 measures, I was wanting to generate a style for 64 measures. I was having trouble doing that. Every time I would generate the style for the, tr the track for the measures, it would end at measure 34. So I need to direct your attention to the pgmusic.com website. That's pgmusic.com. They have a live chat that is open, available during normal business hours during the week. They are excellent. Here's how they had me fix this. If I go over to this folder, they had me look at, this is the band in the box master folder and under a folder called preferences, they had me delete every file that was in here. Now, I'm going to draw your attention to April 22nd, about 11.15 in the morning. This is when I regenerated the track. So they had me come in here and delete all this. Then I went back up here to generate. After I regenerated all the tracks, <clears throat> the style played the full 64 measures. And as you can see now, all these new files showed up in preferences. Once I came back to Band on the Box, I could play the full style. No problem. And you can hear that now. The other nice thing about this, and this is true whether you're troubleshooting or any time, is you can come down here. Let's say you're working on a section of the song that doesn't start at the beginning. Just double click and the track will start playing right there. So this is really good if you're working on something, uh, you don't have the full song in, maybe you want to start on the bridge or the chorus. You can actually go to that measure and work from there. So today, I just wanted to show you that one troubleshooting topic. If you ever have trouble using this DAW plugin standalone from Band on the Box, perhaps it won't play all the measures you want, um, I recommend two things. Get on that Band in the Box, uh, pgmusic.com. Get on their website or reach out to their internal chat. Let them walk you through it. They'll have you clean out that folder, the preferences folder. You'll be able to regenerate this track and you will be good to go. If this was helpful today, I hope you'll let me know. Ask me questions, leave me a comment, thumbs up or thumbs down. Appreciate you joining me. Have a great day.